Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Shayi, and this is The Daily Shayi, where we talk about all things life, beauty, style, etc., etc. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for tuning in and being a real one. Today's video, we are going to be talking about styling some summer neutrals. Neutrals is definitely, uh, I guess I will call it my love language. I like my colors. Don't, don't don't get it twisted i do like my colors but i definitely do lean more towards like the whites the beiges the browns if you are interested to see how to put together some looks for the summer that involve all neutral tones then just continue watching look number one just feels very comfortable and is literally like kind of like the jean and tee outfit just a little bit elevated with a blazer this linen blazer extremely comfortable it is very lightweight it's a linen Type of material blazer i don't believe it's 100 percent linen but it's very comfortable it does not make me feel hot at all in the slightest i also love these jeans i featured them in my uh jean affordable jean try on and these are from zara and i love them because they're fitted at the waist but they also widen out literally starting like right below the waist and so you still get your shape with the fitted waist but then you get like extreme comfortability throughout the rest of the jean and yeah just the oversized aura of this look is seriously a vibe and if you're someone who just kind of likes to throw things on and feel comfortable but still look chic then this look is definitely for you look number two is more so for those who kind of like to add a bit more effort into their styling this top is a bit extra but I'm also extra, so no surprise there. But I got this from Zara a little while ago and I just really like the material. It's essentially feathers and it just makes an outfit just look a bit more dressy than what it actually is. These culottes are also from the Hula Wear collection at Target, but put together, I feel like I'm giving you sort of, I'm supposed to be on a boat vibes. And then I just paired it with a pair of white clear mules and my favorite bucket bag that I picked up from ASOS a little while back. I feel like outfit number three is giving you Jungle Cruise host vibes, <laughs> but make it fashion. I really just like these cargo pants. I featured them in my recent spring call, and then I paired it with this Who What Wear collection top. So fun fact, this top actually matches with the pants you just saw in the previous look. And so that is a set, but when it's broken apart, it pretty much makes an outfit super cute. I really like the cinched waist action, and I paired it with some leopard mules because if we're gonna look like Jungle Safari, we might as well just round it all up and make it look like an entire look. But overall, really just love the aesthetic of this and it feels very comfortable, relaxed. Can you tell we have a theme going here with the belted waistline? I don't know why, I just like pieces like this that help to sort of accentuate the little waist that I do have. I particularly really like this piece. Again, this is a piece I featured in my most recent spring haul and I love the way it's structured. It has sort of like a very structured shoulder pad. I paired it with these white jeans that I have from Everlane and then a pair of black uh, strappy mules and a black purse. Again, very neutral, very basic color palette, but it just feels very fresh and refined. If outfit five was a person, it will literally be me. This outfit is, I would say, the epitome of my personal style. It combines both the relaxed elements with a bit of structure. This button down blouse that I got from Zara a little while ago, it is very airy, very comfortable. Although it's long sleeve, it has a lot of wiggle room. And so it's perfect for summer days, summer nights, where it won't feel like you're dripping in sweat because you're wearing a long sleeve. I also love these split hem jeans. Honestly, cannot wait to wear them once we're out of quarantine. And I paired it with this little structured bag and I feel like it just brought the entire look together. And finally, we are at our last outfit. I absolutely love it because of the split in this skirt. It can be buttoned up 
on the sides down to the bottom but I like keeping it like this because it just makes it feel a bit more sexy a bit more womanly I also love this oversized leopard print top I purposely got it oversized because I knew that I always wanted to wear it either tied up like this or you know kind of super billowy and tucked in this look just feels like I should be at somebody's happy hour at somebody's rooftop just having a little jig a little dance I paired it with the mules, the black mules, and this French purse, but I absolutely love this look. It's very comfortable. The skirt is actually denim, which also just gives it a bit more structure than your traditional midi skirt. And so overall, yes, this is definitely a great way to round out this video. As always, I appreciate y'all for watching today's video and I will catch y'all in my next one. Until next time, bye.